Here's a quick review of Roseville Bradley M case. Uh, obviously made by Roseville. Uh, model name Bradley M. Um, it's one of the newer Roseville cases and uh, I don't think it's gonna be overly popular although it's, it's a rather nice case in person. Uh, in the beginning, right in the beginning I can say that it's pretty much a copy of uh, Corsair Spec 01, Spec 03 uh, series cases. Other than the front panel I would confuse it for Corsair case right away. Um, and it's a bit cheaper, uh, there are some differences, otherwise it's very similar, which is not bad, obviously. Uh, starting from the front, you can see that's the front panel, uh, it doesn't have any filter other than that mesh panel. Uh, there are some openings on sides here for front ventilation, which is nice. And probably you can't see them now, but there are two fans included on the front so it's gonna be a intake an intake uh, for air and uh, here openings on the top there are no fans pre-installed you can install 220 millimeter fans and it doesn't look like you can fit any radiator well, if you can fit radiator probably you won't fit motherboard in the side panel it's actually rather clear it just has got that protective film on it uh, USB 3.0 and okay reset and power buttons it's not really obvious but they are there two buttons the other side nothing special here just protruded panel and that helps with cabling and the back of it one fan installed on the back so it's total three fans one exhaust two intake fans uh, some cutouts for water cooling power supply okay if we take the side panel off that's what we get inside uh, power supply goes in the bottom uh, it's not covered, there is no cover for the power supply, so you can't really hide all the cables. You would have to do it behind the motherboard uh, tray. And that's your space for hard drives. You can install three hard drives total here. And that's the place for an SSD, one SSD. But you can also install a DVD in there and another 5.25 inch device uh, which actually you can use that place uh, with an adapter to install another hard drive or ssd so it's gonna be like five devices total not including the dvd itself cut out here not a lot of space as you can see with the uh, left well it's right panel on uh, the 4-pin cable will have hard time feeding through that hole and power uh, motherboard mounting points. Well, you can't see them, but it's, it's right here on top, right next to the top of the case. So, not a lot of space here. It's obviously more like Corsair Spec 01, because uh, Spec 03 has got more space inside. There is nothing special in the back. Uh, with that side panel on, uh, there is almost like what a little less than an inch of space uh, behind the motherboard tray, so you can do some cabling. Otherwise, it's not that special. No space on top. If you have motherboard with big heat sinks, uh, you may not be able to install fans on top of the case, which is a pity. It's rather like short case it's not tall at all it, it's quite long so you can fit long video cars but it's not tall at, at all completely like for micro ATX case it would have been fine but for uh, mid ATX it's just a bit too smallish and here are all the connections regular ones front panel audio USB 3.0 oh there is another the, another spot for SSD 
I put it on top, you remove that screw and you can remove that little tray where you can put another SSD. So it's two SSDs, three hard drives and another spot here if you'll use an adapter. Filter on the bottom, rather long one, uh, since they also designed it to cover that opening for another 120 millimeter fan. Uh, obviously power supply will suck air in through the filter as well. There is no filter on the front, but there are two fans. And with those three fans installed here, that system probably will be fine for some average gaming computer, which is not bad. It's rather durable, sturdy, you know, side window is nice, ventilation is fine, uh, cabling will take some planning but it's fine as well so it's just an average case uh, if you like that design and if you'll find it with a good price uh, it's not not too bad so this is it thank you for watching and have a good day